Hello again. A mixture of sunny spells and heavy showers for many of us during the rest of Monday. Some of the most lively showers could even contain hail and thunder and lightning, particularly across northern parts of the UK. But just about anywhere could catch one of these lively showers. They'll be whistling through on a keen, gusty, westerly breeze, quickly replaced, mind you, by sunny spells. And it's going to be a mild day in the south, especially 16 or 17 Celsius. A little bit cooler further north, 11 or 12 Celsius for Scotland and parts of Northern Ireland. Showers, as the sun goes down, quickly ease away for central and eastern areas. They'll continue for a time over western shores, but eventually they get replaced by more general rain, arriving into Northern Ireland and western Scotland by the end of the night. A cloud thickening for Scotland, Northern Ireland, parts of Wales and the southwest. As that happens, temperatures will recover after an early dip. But it's going to be a chilly one, I think, for eastern parts of England, for parts of eastern Scotland. Perhaps a touch of grass frost in some sheltered spots and the odd mist patch. Nothing widespread, though, because it will be a breezy start to Tuesday for most and it will turn windier through the day as the isobars tighten. And this warm front crosses northern parts of the UK, bringing a spell of rain for a time. And then we've got this warm sector, a slice of very mild and moist Atlantic air in between a warm front and a cold front. And so it's going to be mild, windy, and there'll be rain at times, particularly across northwestern areas. It will certainly be a wet start for Western Scotland and Northern Ireland. And uh, the main band of rain associated with the warm front, you can see it there, crosses Scotland, Northern England during the morning. It will perhaps give the odd spot of rain further south as well as some thicker cloud. You can see it just clearing the southeast by the afternoon. But otherwise, really further south, it's generally a drier and eventually a brighter day with that wind developing some holes in the cloud. But further north, the thick cloud, the strong wind and outbreaks of rain continue, especially for northwest Scotland. Now, the wind coming from the southwest will mean that it's going to be another mild day, even milder for northern parts of the country and similar temperatures as well for southern areas, 16 or 17, perhaps even 18 Celsius if we get a few cloud breaks towards the east of England. The wet weather becomes persistent there across northwest Scotland and the wind really picks up here on Tuesday evening, 50, 60, perhaps more mile per hour gusts and uh, the wind also bouncing over hills across northern parts of the UK. So a gusty evening to come for northern parts. The isobars there fairly tight and then the weather front sinks on Wednesday into central areas and so it's likely to bring a spell of really persistent rainfall for parts of Cumbria in particular and also some wet weather for Lancashire into North Wales. And that wet weather separating cooler conditions to the north with very mild weather to the southeast. Dry on Wednesday in the southeast and temperatures well above average for the time of year. Full week ahead forecast will be on the YouTube channel later on. And of course, you can stay up to date with all the latest on the Met Office social media channels. Bye bye.